Hello, this is Julie from International Dice Fan Page, I Dice. I received a request to do some unboxing of my dice content. And so, I'll be showing off several of my merch. Um, I will explain where I got everything in the description. So, if you're interested in buying it yourself, you can figure out where you can do that. And also, this isn't everything I own. I do have posters that I won't be showing. Um, they're currently in storage after I moved. Um, I won't be showing my Junin issues or my Boys on Stage issues. Um, Junin in particular, um, to do scans, I unstapled the issues, so they're kind of messy. Um, I won't be showing my photo book in this video. I will do a separate video for that. It is quite long. Um, but yes, other than that, I will be showing all my CDs, all my DVDs, um, several of my merch, including my light stick, a towel, and a t-shirt as well as some of my special photo packs. So let's get started. First up will be Dice's indie album, self-titled. Um, this you can only get from HMV. Um, it was a special um, exclusive to the, their site. Um, possibly someone would be selling it on eBay, but other than that, no, it wouldn't be on Yes Asia or CD Japan. You have to get this one from HMV. So let's take a look. Here's our little spine cover. I usually just stick these in the CDs. Um, they technically make it look better on your bookshelf or wherever you're storing it, but um, they're not like attached onto the CD so they end up flopping off. So generally I just stick it in the CD after I open it. All right, this is the only cover they have um, where it's not actually them, it's the drawing of them. <laughs> Um, of course, you can kind of tell by looking who's who. See the red hair, so it's a you die. <laughs> um, this is also one of the few that comes with an actual photo card inside. See? I got you die. Cartoon version you die. Um, and also on the back, it has like a special superhero pose going on for him. It's, um,. Randomly selected when you buy your CD. And here's the CD itself. Black and sorry, but you can see my fingerprints on this. Um, I play the CD a lot. It's one of my favorites. Um, the lyric books of J-pop CDs are very simple. You have the cover. The lyrics, which include New Day, Splash, Umbrella 5, and Stand. It's a sort of a mini album or, um, you know, an EP instead of an LP. Usually there would be a picture back here, but for this one it's just credits there. Actual images don't show up in the CD, unfortunately. But yes, yeah, so it's a great album. Um, it's kind of hard to get compared to the other ones, but if you can get it, completely worth it. Great album. Next. Is there an indie single? I'll be back. Um, this is the CD only version. You can get a DVD version, but for whatever reason, I got the single version. Just a CD. Here's a little spine cover. I'll be back. Simple design. Frozen time theme. And here's the back. Sorry about the glare. This CD also comes with a photo card. It's the last one that does. Taiki. Looking very stylish in this picture. CD once again, simple design. Black with the red cursive. Nothing underneath. And a very short lyric book. Um, since this is the CD only version, it does come with the English version of I'll Be Back. So we have a little ad right here for their phase one tour. It shows you how long ago I got this. Um, and then the lyrics for I'll Be Back, Setsuna Kute, and the English version of I'll Be Back. Once again, you can get a DVD version of that single. I just, I don't remember why I didn't. I may have been 
a little broke at the time, but yes, you can get the DVD version of that, which will include, I believe it includes the music video for I'll Be Back or some sort of special content regarding the I'll Be Back music video. Next, we're moving along to their first official debut single, which is Shout It Up. Um, nice black and white and red theme. Their official colors. All right. Here's a little spine thing. Um, cover. Back cover. This is actually the DVD version, so it includes the music video and the making of, of Shout It Out. Alright. I really like the CD design. A lot of times they have super simple ones, but I really like this one. Shout It Out. But oh, I hate plastic jewel cases. Um, I'm so worried that when I take the CD out, I'm going to break it. Um, the DVD is the same, but black. And over here, here we have some credits. Um, nice picture of dice. Finally, we got photos of the group going on. Not so much in their indies era. And basically a book. Um, an ad for phase two. And the lyrics of Shout It Out and What You Say. Since this is the DVD version, the English version was not included. But other than that, that's your DVD version. J-pop CDs are quite simple. Okay, next is, ooh, this one is quite special to me. This is the one I got signed by the group in San Jose. Um, so you've got Sota signature, Taiki signature, Tori signature, Yudai signature, and Hayate signature. And right here is where uh, Sota wrote my name in um, Katakana. So yes, I, I love the CD. This is my favorite dice set. Here's a little spine color. Some QR codes. All right, and the back. I'm really fond of this design. I love the um, the light blue. The regular version is orange, actually, but I like the blue version, which comes with the DVD. This is the CD. Toki. And this is the DVD, which includes the music video for Toki and the making of the music video. I always feel like I'm going to break my jewel cases. Um, uh, the photo of the boys in their costume. For the single. Oh, I love seeing that autograph. <laughs> um, this is an ad for their official fan club. And some face two dates. And this has the lyrics for Toki. And sign, which is the peace sign. Oh, yes, I love this album. I'm so glad I picked this to get signed. Still my favorite single by them, their second official single. Alright, after Toki we have Hush Hush. DVD version once again. So we have the pink cover. And a little spine. And once again, just QR codes on the side. On the back. So this comes with Hush Hush, Starting Up, and the UNI um, five voice edit. It's just missing the English version of Hush Hush. Okay, we got a pretty pink CD. And the DVD is silvery or clear, so reflective. You can see my camera. 
um, the DVD, once again, hush hush music video, hush hush making. And some credits over here. Eric Buck, I love this picture of them. <laughs> so cute. Um, why doesn't it want to come out? Okay, there we go. So, cover. Once again, this is um, for their fan club. And we have the lyrics for Hush Hush, Starting Up, and the You and I Five voice edit. So, I suppose you get one extra B side on this one compared to the earlier albums, but Hush Hush English version is only available on the regular CD only version of this album. Which, of course, also has a different cover and color scheme. So, one of these days, maybe I'll collect them all, but I'm still a little broke, so. <laughs> all right, this one is a slightly flat unboxing. Um, fight back. <laughs> um, I actually lost the spine cover when I was moving. Um, I think it should still be around somewhere, like, jammed in one of my other CDs. Yeah, that was bad of me, but yeah. Um, this is the CD-only version. Um, I was probably broke once again when I bought this one, because I usually do try to buy the DVD versions. I should actually go back and get the DVD version of Fight Back. Um, and what this has is it has, um, glare, uh, member profiles on the front and, um, sort of a short group description up here, um, and then the member names are right here. So it's kind of designed, like, I suppose, a newspaper ad or a magazine article. Kind of cool. Um, here we have this going on in the back. This is their first full-length album. Here's a CD, black, and it's an 11 song tracklist, and another fan club ad, and I, yeah, we're into phase three by now, end of 2014, and finally, finally, we have a long lyric book, um, pretty much the albums is the only one you get one with more than just the lyrics inside. You can actually have photos in this too. Um, we start off with the checklist. And then the lyrics, right back. Oh, and look, it's you time. Finally, we have images in the actual lyric book. Shout it out. And we have Toru and Bomb, because Toru is the bomb. Taiki with noise and Toki. Sota with hash hash. Sota Hanamura. Hayate with did you know? So it's going not in age order because Yudai was first. Um, stay and I still love you. Starting up and lost love. And then finally we have the credits and some QR codes. So even though there's images, there's just one of each member. If you are um, used to getting K-pop CDs, J-pop CDs can be underwhelming, but I, I feel that they tend to make up for it in DVD content, which I suppose it doesn't work so much for this one because I didn't actually get the DVD. But once again, just getting those 11 tracks is awesome because Fight Back is a great debut album. So now we're moving into 2015 with their first seasonal single, which came out in winter, Moichiro Dake. Um, we're back to the DVD version. And here's the spine cover. And for this promotion, they started having things on the back of the spine cover. And most of them make sense, but this one doesn't really. I wish for your smile next to the last man. Um, I get the I wish for your smile part, but 
Not so much what they mean by last man or next to the last man. We can forget them though because <laughs> it's a great single. And they have them there with the piano. Okay. So here we have this CD. And the DVD, which once again has Moichiro Dake music video making up. piano here with the QR codes. Wait, no ad. Maybe I threw it away by accident. Um, yeah, once again, a little bit of damage. That's my bad. Um, or actually that was the mailman's bad. <laughs> um, he left this out. Um, in a, like a soft envelope package in the middle of a storm when I got it from my doorstep. Um, yeah, it was soaked. Um, I think that's the only one that had this problem though. Yeah, and that's why the spine thing is kind of wrinkly too. Oh well. At least he got that one there on time on like some other CDs. Okay, here we have Billion Dreams. All right, Billion Dreams. Okay, now this sign cover. Beautiful because Taiki's on it. <laughs> um, yes, I can't actually do math in my head. Um, if I remember correctly, I think this was supposed to end up as 365 to represent um, every season, which would be coming out later. Um, I could probably do the math right now to check to see if I'm remembering that correctly, but no, I don't like math. So we're just going to move on to the CD. Um, beautiful spring design. I love it. And then we have them on the back. Okay, so DVD version. So once again, we have... <laughs> I always, I'm always afraid I'm going to break it. Um, and then we have white. Very nice. Ooh, ooh, okay. <laughs> um, some flower designs with the QR codes. Yeah, we're on to face four now. Okay, and we have Billion Dreams and Fashionable. Um, this was the first one when they started doing iTunes only songs. So, um, Hate and Toru's um, duet was on the iTunes version of this and uh, Taiki Solo. But unfortunately, you couldn't get them on the CD version itself. But the DVD version comes with um, music video I'm making of again. And this was the first version when they started doing member cover versions. So since they hadn't started doing two DVD versions, I was like, what the hell, go get Sota, my boy Sota. But you still have a Taiki on the slip cover. And once again, the same math equation. Um, same back image. Um, this one's pink themed like the the regular version of Billion Dreams. So we have a pink CD. The flower design. And the exact same interior other than this one. You have the English version of uh, Billion Dreams because it's the member versions have the same content as regular version CDs. So yeah, my Sota CD. And then after that, they started doing two DVD versions per album. And I'm not swimming in money, so I had to cut out getting Sota versions. I will probably go back and get some more of him. 
because I love him. But as you'll see, we, everybody era started doing two DVD versions per comeback single. So everybody, slipcase cover, we got Yudai. January brings April, August, and dot, dot, dot. Everybody, guess what we're going to say? So it's hinting that upcoming would be a, a new season, a new single for the new season, which would eventually lead to every season. So we got the nice summer costumes. Once again, on the Phase 4 ad. Okay, we have the single. No, 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 no. Yes. <laughs> and then we have the DVD. Um, this is limited A, so it has the music video I'm making of, like all the other ones did. And we have some palm fronds going here. Credits. They stopped putting number photos in the back for the every season uh, leading up singles. It's too bad. Um, track list is everybody. And oh, I love this song, Bambi Ride. Okay. And then next is the limited B version of everybody. Um, this is pretty much the same, except you have Sota, because the back pose is slightly different, but it has the same message. So here's the limited B cover in the back and since this is a second DVD it has different content this has a special dance routine um, called Moments by Taiki Toru and Hayate and then there's a making of that dance routine later we would find out that it pairs with Toki Acoustic version which came out in the Hello single here we go and we have blue CD I'm kind of hesitating to pop them out because it always feels like it's going to break. Um, and as I said, the DVD is the special dance routine with the dance line, as well as the making of that routine. Here's some palm pounds. And the exact same lyric book, except it's blue this time, everybody in BB writing. Um, on the iTunes only version of this, you would have. Um, I believe this is the one that, yeah, this is the one that came with Sota's um, solo, Beer Man, and Yudai solo, which was my dearest. They didn't come on the CD version of Everybody, but you can get them that way, and it's on the um, vocal version of Every Season.